Amid the fallout from his recent interview with Dax Shepard, Harry has been warned to be careful what he reveals in the media. Speaking today, commentator Camilla Tomini claimed there is a degree of exploitation going on with the Duke. As he and his wife, Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, attempt to kickstart their life following the fallout with the royal family, Ms. Tomini claimed some broadcasters may look to exploit the pair. Speaking on this morning, Ms. Tomini claimed it is unlikely broadcasters have his interests at heart. She said, going over to America, the other side of the coin you could say is that there is a degree of exploitation going on. The Americans are rubbing their heads together with glee. They know this man is quite damaged, disenfranchised from his family. I know they have a living to earn and they are seeking financial independence in America, but let's just handle all of this with care. They both had a difficult time. Neither of them have a particularly good relationship with a large portion of their families, and then you got people hosting podcasts thinking, brilliant, this will get the ratings. Despite Ms. Tomini's comments, Harry and Meghan stepped back from royal life in order to avoid media scrutiny in the UK. The pair also did so in order to become more financially independent and have since signed deals with Netflix and Spotify. Although Ms. Tomini claimed he may be being exploited by some broadcasters, Harry has also used some of his appearances to talk of his own mental health struggles and what he is doing to aid others. In the interview with Shepard, Harry revealed he had received therapy to help him with some of his mental health struggles. It was during a therapy session the Duke evaluated multiple aspects of his personality and realized his own privilege. The Duke also revealed the Invictus Games had helped realize what injured servicemen and women had gone through and the impact the event had on them. However, Ms. Tomini warned the Duke not to talk of his father's own mental issues, if there any, in public. She said, I think you can talk about your own mental health but you have to be aware of the consequences on other people's. Like the fact the Queen has just buried her husband, the father of Prince Charles, and then the son is over across the Atlantic having a go about the way HES been brought up.